but from both winners and losers, the competition produced wonderful horsemanship. Heavy rain fails to dampen spirits at Barrow and Furness when HMS Invincible, the Navy's newest 167 million pounds fighting ship, prepares for launching by Her Majesty the Queen. A crowd of 15,000 brave the weather to be at the launching of the new ship and to see the Queen and Prince Philip. Invincible is the first of three cruisers to be completed in British yards. She carries a name that has been carved with pride in British naval history. I name the ship Invincible. May God bless her and all who stay in her. A bottle of elderberry wine sets Invincible off on her career. Sixteen thousand tons, powered by four Rolls-Royce Olympus gas turbines, Invincible is the Navy's first anti-submarine cruiser. Invincible will carry a powerful complement of Sea Harrier vertical takeoff jets, guided missiles, and Sea King helicopters. Both the Queen and Prince Philip take a keen interest in the mechanics of the launching. And Invincible. miraculous British invention, the jump jet, shows the pattern of air-sea warfare today. Invincible, a formidable link in the chain of Britain's defences. A launching too on the River Hamble in southern England, but not a gun in sight. 